News Channel 15's Holly Campbell caught up with people after the rally and joins us now with their reaction. Well, like we said, more than 2,000 people filled the Expo Center at the Coliseum. Some even showed up six hours before the rally even started. And most everyone I talked to says if they weren't already avid supporters of Dr. Carson, they are now. It was a packed house as Dr. Ben Carson took the stage. I love it. I think he's so inspiring, and I love how honest he is. Very impressed. Liked his uh, policies and his uh, his Christian beliefs. For many, it was their first time seeing a presidential candidate. I loved it. I thought we're right on the same page. But for 14-year-old Christopher Hattery, it was one of many. Two Mitt Romney rallies and one Obama rally. Hattery says after vetting the other candidates, he's standing behind Carson, even though he isn't old enough to vote. I like to know like how my government's going, how my country's doing, and I'd like to get the information and the basic facts about it so I can inform my parents about it. And Hattery wasn't the only team there to see the doctor. I just got a selfie of Dr. Carson. I asked him if he had any advice for my history class I chose tomorrow. He said, learn how you learn. Don't change how you learn for, to fit the school. People tell me before tonight's rally, they were supporters of Dr. Ben Carson, but they tell me after hearing his message here in Fort Wayne, they're leaving even bigger fans. I like him even more. I hope everybody rallies behind him and we fix everything. We've got to make a change for better in this country, and uh, I think this is what we need. Hattery may have another four years before he can legally vote, but he knows how important it is and hopes Carson will be on the ballot when the time comes. Every single vote matters. That's why when I vote, I'm going to make sure I vote for the right person. I asked Christopher Hattery, the young man who has been to four presidential candidate rallies, how Carson stacked up to Romney and Obama. He says Carson seemed more down to earth and more relatable to other people. So there's a little analysis for you. Holly Campbell, News Channel 15.